Here at Little Bighorn Battlefield National Monument, artifacts from the past are popping up more frequently. Visitors found a Civil War cuff button just last week. Welcome to Little Bighorn Battlefield National Monument. The park memorializes the last stand the Lakota and Cheyenne tribes took against the U.S. Army's 7th Cavalry to preserve their way of life. This was the campaign to round up all the American Indians from their natural nomadic um, hunting um, way of lifestyle. It's no wonder that around 400,000 people visit the monument each year. It's considered to be a destination park. Visitors that come here, they come here for this, this, this reason of the of the battle. And if you're lucky, you might come across a piece of history yourself, like visitors did last week. They took a picture of this button that they found out on the battlefield. Multiple visitors found the button and did the right thing by leaving the artifact where it stood, letting park rangers remove it themselves. Even though it was a small uniform cuff button or a vest button, it all helps to tell the story of what took place here. And park rangers are grateful they can preserve this little piece of history. It's important to think about if you take it, it's yours, but you cheat everybody else out of it. Tim and Jerry Francis are visiting from Mechanicsville, Virginia. I wanted to really bad pick a, a piece of wheat up the, and dry it and put it in my scrapbook, but Tim's like, you can't do that, you're in a national park. I went, oh, okay. <laughs> put that, that. And Tim's on the right track, as it's a $5,000 fine if you're caught removing an artifact from National Park Service property. And it could even mean jail time. It's a good reminder since more artifacts have started popping up in recent months. Shell casings, buttons, just relics, relics of the battle. The artifacts have been cataloged in the park's archives and are now in a storage facility, safe and sound. And park rangers hope visitors will come out and learn more about American history. This sacred place, this special place, belongs to everyone, all, all Americans. In Bighorn County, Alina Howder, MTN News.